Hello, I'm Trent O'Donnell from the University of New South Wales. Today, we plan to perform a dissection of the laboratory rat Rattus norvegicus var albinus, which have been purpose-bred for this class. We choose to dissect laboratory rats primarily because their organs are large, they are prolific breeders and their destruction does not harm natural ecosystems. The brown rat becomes sexually mature in 8 to 10 weeks, has a gestation period of typically 3 weeks, litters of 2 to 14, and approximately 4 to 6 litters per year. Because their lifespan is approximately 2 to 3 years, a female brown rat can potentially give birth to over 200 offspring in her lifetime. Although brown rats can spread disease to humans, those bred in captivity for dissection are usually disease and parasite free. Although they have poor vision, their sense of smell, hearing and taste are very acute. They are typically 40 centimetres long when fully grown, with a scaly tail that is roughly half their body length. The wild type has a brown or brown-grey coloration. Their body mass ranges from 180 to 480 grams. The brown rat and the black rat were introduced to Australia by the early European fleets. Both compete with native wildlife and are destructive to property or foodstuffs. Australia has seven native species in the genus Rattus. If you have obtained prior consent to be omitted from this laboratory exercise for religious or ethical reasons, then please consult your laboratory demonstrator now.